Here we have an application question on corresponding paths and CPCT. Our question is in the map given below. Triangle PQR is congruent to triangle BCA. So this is triangle PQR. We can join point Q to point P. Point P to point R and point Q to point R. So we can see that PQR forms a triangle here. Similarly, we can form a triangle BCA also. Joining point B to point A. Point A to point C. And point B to point C. So BCA is also the triangle. Now PQ is given to be 3 kilometers. So this is PQ. This is 3 kilometers. And QR is given to be 700 meters. So this is QR. And this is given in the question as 700 meters. We have to find the distance between A and C. That means this distance. And distance between B and C as well. That means this distance. It is given in the question that triangle PQR is congruent to triangle BCA. So this is given that triangle PQR is congruent to triangle BCA. So by CPCT we will have PQ is equal to BC and QR is equal to CA. This implies BC that means the distance between points B and C will be BC is equal to PQ and PQ is given to be 3 kilometers. So BC is 3 kilometers that is the distance between points B and C. Also this implies that CA will be equal to now CA is given equal to QR and QR is 700 meters. So this is 700 meters the distance between points A and C. Let's summarize how we did this question. It was given that triangle PQR is congruent to triangle BCA. Therefore, corresponding sides PQ was equal to BC, QR was equal to CA and PR equal to BA by CPCT. Then we found the required distances BC and CA by knowing the lengths of QR and PQ.